Hey y'all! Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to just be catching up with you guys because it's been a while yet again, but I'm going to give you guys a little shopping haul that I just did. Um, first off, I apologize if you hear the extreme winds that are going on outside. It literally was so hot and so sunny earlier today. And then on my way home just now from the mall, it got really dark and super windy. So it's Oklahoma for you. Um, yeah, just a little life to update. Um, for those who are interested, I actually recently was promoted um, at the company that I've worked for for like nearly 10 years probably at this point. But that was really exciting. I also have kind of taken off um, in my jewelry um, little side business that I've been doing. Um, I'm not sure if I've talked about it much in my YouTube videos, but I have a little jewelry side business. Actually, I make more than just jewelry, but it's all handmade stuff and I donate 20% to animal shelters and rescues and that has been going really well. I've been doing pop-up shops and craft shows and it's been going so good and it makes all the late nights after work working worth it, if you know what I mean. So that's really exciting as well. Um, other than that, that's pretty much all that's been going on. My husband and I bought kayaks recently and so that's been really fun to play around with but otherwise just working and playing when we can really um so i went on a shopping spree today a little like shopping spree for myself just kind of to celebrate all the great things that have been happening lately um i recently went through like little health scares that had me kind of stressed out and worried um but i got test results back and all of that came back um really good so that's exciting and yeah i just felt like there was a lot to celebrate and i had some extra money this week um from working my craft shows and it going really well so i figured why not treat myself because i feel like i deserve it and I'm my own boss when it comes to my side business business so yeah anyways I'm gonna stop trying to justify the amount of money I just spent which I'm really not even sure how much it was I mean it was probably under $200 but to me that feels like a lot of money um anyways let's get into this little shopping spree haul okay I just lost power back on all right, back in business. The first place that I ended up going, I believe, was Forever 21. So this is my bag. Um, I don't shop at Forever 21 very much anymore, but I love their stuff. Like every time I get online and try to shop on Forever 21, I always think it's so cute. But I think the problem is that I always end up spending too much money, which I'm realizing is a lot easier to do online than it is in person. I actually made a point to go and try on all of the clothes that I got today, which really made the buying process so much easier. Like I went into American Eagle and I would have spent so much more money than I did because I tried, like I didn't spend as much money because I tried stuff on. But to start off from Forever 21, I spent $52 and I got this little, let's see, I got this little dress. This dress was actually, it was on sale for $5 and um, it was final sale. It was the only one I saw and it happened to be a small, but it's this little sage green like mini dress and you guys know sage green is all the rage right now so i tried this on and surprisingly like this little ruffle detail actually like went perfectly under my boobs which usually doesn't typically happen it's always like too low or too high or like just look weird looking but this actually looked so cute so i'll show you guys what it looks like on in the little try on portion so i got that dress and i don't know if you can tell but it's actually like this really pretty ribbed material and then it has the lettuce trim so cute for five dollars okay you got me sold okay let's see the next thing i got i really went back and forth on whether i even wanted it or not um because it's kind of trendy and i feel like 
this trend doesn't make a lot of sense to me necessarily. So that trend is these sweater vests. So this sweater vest was $14.99, I believe. Yeah, $14.99. Um, so a pretty good price. Like it was not like it was expensive or anything, but I just don't understand the whole like wearing a sweater only over your torso area and not your extremities because that's usually what's cold. Um, typically for me, maybe. Is that weird? I don't know. But um, I actually tried the sweater vest on with an item that I got from Ram from American Eagle and in the dressing room I did and it was so cute and I was like okay this with like a tennis skirt which I'll I'll actually try to style it like that in the little try on portion for you guys but yeah I just thought it actually was really cute even though it doesn't make a lot of logical sense to me <laughs> um and then I was just about to check out with that brown one whenever I just decided like I need a black one too like if I'm gonna get one I freaking love wearing black and neutral colors but like all black is my favorite outfit if I can wear anything that's just head to toe black black top black shoes black pants black socks like black everything I'm like in my heaven like I love wearing all black so I had to get one in black it just is what it is and then the last thing I got from forever 21 this is something that I don't typically actually I only have one of these and that's a bodysuit and I've never worn it. Um, I don't know what about bodysuit suits typically are just not my jam, but I saw this one. If I can get it untangled. So I saw this one, just a little simple black bodysuit. It clips at the bottom and it has these really thin like spaghetti straps on it and it's a ribbed material as you can see and it's black so i was like you know what like the black tank tops that i have that i typically would tuck in which i mean is why i haven't bought body suits because it's like you can just tuck in one of your 50 tank tops that you have um but yeah the the black tank tops that i have are kind of a thin material and they don't look very nice and honestly they're probably probably like five to eight years old at this point so they're not the nicest um which is why i just decided to go ahead and get the bodysuit it was actually really comfortable it fit me really well and it wasn't see-through um i really wanted to, to get a white one but all of them i was finding was see-through so and i don't wear a bra <laughs> so putting that out there anyways so that's all that i got from forever 21 and then i'm actually really enjoying that okay so the next store that i went to was american eagle i got just a few little things from here um let's see so i ended up spending it was 37.95 is what i spent at american eagle for two items which to me feels like a lot for two things that are just tops so it says that I saved $9.96 which thank goodness because if <laughs> I had it and I had to pay that much more I would feel even more like it was not worth it but so the few things that I got were one of them is this tank top I don't know if you can tell it's showing up like really light gray on the camera if I can dim the light maybe you can see Okay, so that's showing it a bit better. It's this really kind of like acid washed gray. Um, at first, at first I thought it was like black, but it really is kind of like more of an acid washed gray. It has a lot of like kind of heathered effect in it and a lot of wear, and it's kind of like a little bit of a waffle knit, if you can tell. It's a little bit waffled so I just thought it was like a perfect essential tank and it was only like $9.99 so I was like you know what just get it all right and then with this item I actually put it down and went back for it three times before I just was like you know what if you've gone back for it three times you want it okay by the way I apologize that my dog is gnawing away on a bone behind me so if you hear crunching that's what it is um so yeah the other thing that I got from American Eagle was this little collared t-shirt and it's cropped and it's like a little bit tighter 
so I actually really liked it by my by itself and I felt like it would look really cute with a tennis skirt um, or shorts you know with like a like a um, flannel over it or something like that but yeah that was kind of my vision for that top and then with that on with the sweater vest I thought it was actually really adorable so I got that and that was all I got from American Eagle and then this this really the last thing I guess so um, the last place that I went to which I need to go to this store more often which is Claire's because I walked in and it was actually so adorable there was actually so much stuff that I thought was really cute and colorful and like trendy I was really shocked and it was all really affordable because it's probably mostly for kids but that's okay so I spent $14.10 I got um it was like buy one get one half off or whatever so that's from Claire's and I really was on the hunt for just a really simple pair of gold hoop earrings I kept finding some that were either really big or some that were too small or some that were too thick or whatever but these I thought were actually really cute and really like perfect for what I was looking for and they were only $5.99 so that was that and I was only gonna get those and then the cashier was like no you need to get something else oh you deserve something else or whatever so i'll give you buy one half off so like that wasn't even a sale they were running i don't think she was just like go get you something so i did i actually two days ago broke my big clip that i was using in my hair so i went ahead and just got another one um let's see which was 9.99 so i have a more difficult time with clips because my hair is actually really thick it might be short but like like clips like this that are like this small will never hold my hair up like even when i have it in a section to straighten it or something like it doesn't hold i have to have a big clip so like like you can see like how thick that is around and that's with it twisted so yeah, I needed a clip that would actually work, and I'm glad that this does. I definitely don't wear this out. <laughs> I use them whenever I'm washing my face um, so that my hair tie doesn't pull it out. But I don't know, maybe it could be cute for like a little like half up, half down situation. Like, is that cute? I don't know. I never do hairstyles. I just like it down. Either down or up, one or the other. So yeah, I guess that was really all that I got. It wasn't very much, but it felt really nice to kind of treat myself and just walk around aimlessly and look around stores. Uh, to be honest, there was a lot more stuff that I could have got if like I just had no cares in the world. Like I really wanted like five pairs of Skechers. I love Skechers. Um, there was a lot of stuff out there. So, you know, I was trying to be a little bit more frugal with my money but it was still fun and I'm really excited about the stuff that I got to make outfits and things like that so anyways thanks you all so much for watching I hope to see you guys in the next one and hopefully it's not so far between now and the next one but I thank you anyways and I hope you guys have a great rest of your weekend great rest of your day see you in the next one bye